Earlier today, Gulf County commissioners decided that more of their residents need to evacuate. News Channel 7's JT Lynch has been there yesterday into today, following along with the storm prep and the coverage. He joins us now live. JT. I'm here in Port St. Joe, where earlier today there were talks from the county commissioners here in Gulf County about evacuation zones. Well, about an hour ago in an emergency meeting, they decided to expand that area. And when we talk about the evacuations that were happening earlier on today, that was in places like Indian Pass, Cape San Blas, and Simmons Bayou. Now they have issued mandatory evacuations for Highland View, Windmark, St. Joe Beach, and Beacon Hill to the county line, all by 8 a.m. tomorrow. They also issued mandatory evacuations for the city of Port St. Joe from the Bay to Garrison Avenue. Those looking for a place to stay can find it in Weewahitchka at the Honeyville Community Center. They are setting up a shelter there right now. The doors to that shelter do not open until 8 a.m. Eastern Time, 7 a.m. Central Time tomorrow. In Port St. Joe, JT Lynch, News Channel 7. Wow, all right. Thank you, JT.